The next letter from the letters of the Arabic alphabet is the letter Qaf. The letter Qaf comes from the lisan, the tongue, and more specifically, the furthest part of the tongue with what corresponds to it from the roof of the mouth, the soft palate. And from the characteristics of the letter Qaf is isti'ala, i.e. that the back of the tongue is raised. As such, it's going to be pronounced heavy. Likewise, when it has sukun, then the attribute or the characteristic of qalqala will be pronounced. From the common mistakes in pronouncing the letter qaf is to pronounce it like a kaf. So for example, qalu, some people pronounce it as kalu, kalu. Likewise, some people may forget to put the qalqala on the letter qaf when it has sukun. Also, although less common in what I've heard, is to pronounce the letter Qaf as a G sound in English.